Hi there and welcome to how to set up Connected Drive and my BMW app. You are going to need today an access to an Apple or Android smartphone, around 10 to 15 minutes and access to your vehicle as well to make sure that all of the features are fully set up. So we are firstly going to download the my BMW app in either the App Store or Google Play Store. This shouldn't take too long to download, but once the app is there, open it up for me and just tick that box to agree the terms and conditions and agree. It will now ask you to create a user account if you are a new user. Please do so by typing in an email address and a memorable password twice so that it sends you an email confirmation. An email should arrive shortly which will let you know about activating your BMW ID. I'd like you to go into that email and tick that big blue box that says activate and that will take you to a website to confirm that you are a real user and it will show you that it is activated. Nice and simple so far. We're now going to go back to the app and log in with the username and password that you have set up. When you log in and hit log in for the first time, it may take a few moments for it to load through with a little swirly circle to confirm that everything is set up. But what you should now see after that setup is it will ask you to type in a four digit pin, something like this, and you can type that in twice and then it will take you through to a page to agree terms and conditions. This is very important as it allows you to get the most out of the app. The next bit will require us going to the vehicle and typing in the full VIN number, which you can find on the corner of the windscreen as seen here. Once you've fully typed this in, it will then send a security code directly to the car's system. Though the process may vary between vehicles, it's relatively close to the same. Press communication and select BMW messages and enter the six digit security code back into your phone. It will take up to 24 hours for everything to show, but then you're done. So what does the app do? Well, I can see status information on the vehicle in terms of mileage and whether the vehicle is locked or unlocked. I can flash headlights, lock and unlock the car. If it's a hybrid or electric vehicle, I can charge and set climatization. On the map, I can actually find a location on that map or type in a postcode if I wish and send it directly to the vehicle. So it really will help us and save time with everyday use. That's just a few things that can be done in this app. But if you're not technologically conscious, don't worry, you don't need to use the app, but we do recommend getting it set up so that the car can work best. One last thing, if you have a screen that looks like this, then tick into driver profiles in the car settings and hit add driver profile by logging in directly to your BMW ID. Type in the email address and password that you've typed in and then, as you can see on the screen here, it will ask me to accept a few terms, conditions and settings. And then it's going to use cloud based driver profile technology to use the best features in the car, which then will also greet me by name. If you do struggle, feel free to get in contact with myself, Aidan Smith, on telephone or email. But congratulations on your purchase and enjoy your new BMW. Thank you.